My name is Jeroen Huizinga, and within John Crane, I'm responsible in the filtration product line for product marketing and business development, which is a double role basically. Uh, on one side, focusing on the products, the trends, and the new deliveries, and on the other side, around the market, the customer base, uh, discovering what is required next and translating that into the business. Filtration quite often is perceived as like a black box. Something goes into a filter and goes out. What happens inside is basically the capturing of contamination. So a fluid which contains contaminants needs to be cleaned and um, um, basically the contaminants to be taken out to make the system working properly. The contaminants which are inside a fluid can consist of uh, solid particles. Solid particles can come from rust, it can be by sand depending on the nature of the system where the filter is installed in. And that's the, typically for liquid applications. Liquid applications, think about uh, lubrication oil, think about water, where these impurities can cause downstream the filter for damage into the rotating equipment. For the um, liquid filtration, typically the efficiencies required in today's standards, whereby the API norms are the most uh, common requirements for the filtration equipment in our field. Filtration consists of two parts for fine filtration. It's the fineness and it's the efficiency. Fine filtration we define typically of uh, efficiencies down to the micron level. 3 micron, 5 micron, 10 micron. To reach these kind of level of filtration for these fineness, efficiency is important as well. Because the filtration technology used to take out these size of, uh, sizes of impurities um, are taken out by uh, non-woven materials, whereby the efficiency is calculated in percentages or what is more common in filtration will, in beta ratios, whereby in percentages wise efficiencies typically go up to 99.5% efficiency or even 99.9%. John Crane seal gas filtration systems already protect thousands of your mission critical operations. Dry gas seal equipped centrifugal compressors require a constant supply of clean, dry, filtered gas. So filtration performance directly affects reliability and OPEX. Now, new Indifil SCF seal gas filtration performance results in the best protection for your critical equipment, evident process savings and operational advantages. The new seal gas filtration system from John Crane is a more efficient and compact design to save space and energy. To reach optimal performance, the system flow needs to be streamlined. Conditioning the flow is particularly important when used in combination with three-way valves or 90-degree bends, where the efficiency of the filtration process is adversely affected by the resulting flow vorticity. The outward directed motion of the vortex naturally increases the velocity in the wet band of the filter element increasing the likelihood of droplet re-entrainment and reducing efficiency. The result is that the dry gas seal is not optimally protected and a relatively high system pressure drop is seen. Such inefficiencies are the cause of unplanned downtime, more maintenance and increased OPEX. Using computational flow dynamics, a more efficient solution has been developed to ensure the best protection for your dry gas seal applications. The Indufil FCF series coalescing filters has a combination of new flow conditioning technologies to deliver increased process efficiency in a smaller unit. Additive manufacturing is used to create a custom flow straightener built into the inlet of each filter element. Its honeycomb structure removes vortices from the gas flow and secures an optimum streamlined flow where it matters most. CFD analysis also showed that filter size matters. Using the ideal diameter to length ratio for each filter size enables even flow distribution, further reduction in droplet reentrainment, and improved coalescing performance. And the use of new hydrophobic treated filter media improves droplet drain speed. As standard, contaminants of 1 micron and smaller are removed at efficiencies of 99.9%. .9 the new John Crane seal gas filtration system delivers significantly reduced pressure drop and optimized process flow with up to 50% lower pressure drop both at startup and in operation, plus increased flow capacity up to 60%. Systems are available in single and duplex configuration, specified precisely to your application 
complying with international pressure vessel and design codes, and fully compliant with API 692. New Indufil FCF filtration systems enhance centrifugal compressor reliability and deliver crucial operational efficiencies. Setting new standards in seal gas filtration. Today, tomorrow, together. I'm Rogier Verheyen. I'm with John Crane for nine years. I'm a product manager and I work for filtration products, typically for the turbo machinery equipment. My role includes following the latest customer requirements and challenges and make sure that John Crane has a suitable filtration solution, even in the most critical cases. Most centrifugal compressors today use dry gas seals to seal the shaft compressor, the process gas. The gap between the rotating and stationary phases of the seal is very small, only about 3 to 5 microns, and requires absolute clean and dry gas. Filtration technologies are used to remove both particle and liquid contaminations. Failing to provide clean gas puts the gas seals at risk and can lead to increased unplanned downtime and the consequential repair and cost involved. In 2018, the new API 692 was released. It's the new and latest industry standard for dry gas seals and systems for centrifugal compressors. Over time, it will supersede the still frequently used API 614. What we see is that the API requirements are more stringent on both fineness and performance. One of the changes is the requirement for one micron at 99.9% .9 performance, where API 614 required only four micron at 98.8% performance. Besides the increased performance requirements, the new API also prescribes to take the total differential pressure drop over the complete filter system into account. This can have considerable effect and impact on the size of your seal gas filter and the consequential costs. The increased industry standards and customer insights have triggered John Crane to develop a next generation seal gas filter. The filter decreases both the clean and operational pressure drop significantly. This makes the filter a good match specifically when the API 692 sizing requirements are applicable. Furthermore, we discovered technology to reduce the filter footprint but at the same time, keep the flow the same. But most important, we could achieve a validated coalescing performance of 0.005 ppm. This performance guarantees dry gas and the best protection for your gas seal. When our engineers redesigned the filter system, thorough CFD analysis revealed that the gas flow behavior and velocity through the filter system plays an important role in performance and pressure drop. A combination of flow optimizing technologies in both the filter system and filter element have ensured the flow is conditioned throughout the complete filter. One example is that we discovered that because of transfer valves and pipe bands, the gas flow shows a vortex, which is a whirling motion of the gas. This causes higher gas velocity in the bottom part of the filter element, where most of the liquid is drained. This creates an increased chance of reentrainment of the drained droplets back into the gas flow. To better condition the flow before it enters the filter element, John Crane has developed a flow straightening technology. This is a metal honeycomb structure at the inlet of the filter element that efficiently removes the vortex from the gas flow. Safety is a critical part of the new filter system design. To validate the performance and capability, we have fully tested the new filter system in accordance with all industry requirements. Besides being hydro tested, the filters are also fugitive emission certified to meet the highest safety standards. The particle performance is validated per the latest API 692 requirement according the ISO 12500 test protocols. Whether you are a compressor manufacturer or the user of the equipment, 
we understand your filtration needs and are able to specify the exact system to your requirements, whether API 614 or API 692.